Happy Friday, friends. November 20th. And guess what? We're retesting our 20 rep back squat. Aha! That's so exciting. Um, for those of you that have been here every day for that 20 rep and the percentage work, know how sucky that percentage work has been, but it's going to all pay off today. All right. So what are we starting off with? Uh, core temperature warm up is a three minute assault bike top of every minute including zero four total jump switch lunges then what are we doing we are gonna have let's do three minutes of stretching led by the coach all right three to four minutes roughly here because we will have the time um coaches have this be uh focus on hips uh hamstrings ankles and maybe even a little bit of that uh thoracic spine okay somewhere around there coaches you get a pick uh, then PT specific for completion, 15 glute bridges. Don't load your lower back. Keep those abs tight. Four PVC squats while bending the bar. Haven't done this in a while, but we do love keeping that tension. Helps us keep a nice solid back. Uh, 10 cycling clamshells each side. We did these earlier this week. Remember, uh, feet behind knees. And then four PVC squats again, bending the bar. Then 30 second hollow body hold. Um, holding a plate, you're gonna have that plate behind you. We just gotta get that uh, midline warmed up and ready to be braced for quite a while. Four more squats and then ton total reverse lunges. Cool. Remainder of time, coaches. What are we doing here? Um, remind everyone how to squat properly again. And we're gonna take some time to build to a heavy one to two rep squat. Once again, this isn't so much to build to a max. It's more so much to kind of overload that body a little bit um, so that when we do go for that 20 rep, those numbers feel, I mean, that weight feels lighter. And you're like, boom, 20, awesome. So once again, we need to choose right wisely. You should feel as though you are going to you might start to fail at rep 14, but you won't. Even though it's 20 of them, friends, one big thing I did notice is that people are trying to go through those so fast. Yes, you don't want to go super, super slow. However, you need to make sure you're braced every single time you go in that squat and you're controlled on the way down so you can be explosive on the way up. So when I coached this the last time and then I'm gonna do it again, I want everyone to take that big breath in before each rep. Keep that breath and that tension until you stand back up. And that squat. Once again, one of the hardest things you're going to do in your life. Oh, and one of the hardest things you're going to do in the gym. Um, and uh, uh, males will be using around 70, 75% of their one rep max. Women will be a little bit higher. Um, if you are someone that did this last time, guys... Let's go for five, 10 pounds more. We'll see what happens. If you're someone that, um, when we did the 20 rep, or like you you got done last time, you're like, man, I had quite a bit more in the tank. Let's get that more in the tank this time. Um, this is gonna be a fun workout. I love it. I'm excited to see how much stronger, not only physically, but mentally people are. Love you, bye.